now episode 4 here on the 10x server from our Roman Leopard account. And um, yeah, a little update to the after artifacts. Um, I think we got a few more artifacts after yesterday's uh, recording. Uh, nothing really worth to show you. Um, on our account, we got two new villages since yesterday. We placed our own rotation village for uh, for unique eyes, so we can move them to here from Cap instead. Um, basically, just because we need the storage active, we just took that earlier. So, so we have to move that. So we sell this today. This is how the infrastructure is looking. Just the storage for making a uh, treasury twenty. You need three barrels twenty and one. Uh, Run over 20, otherwise just slowly simming it up. I mean, it's not important at all this village. And then we achieved um, storage here, storage artifacts, the rotation village that was placed here by Yoda. Um, it's kind of our job to keep it safe together with the large eyes, our unique guys. Um, should work out just fine. Um, yeah, we can take a look at the treasure chamber here. Guys active since yesterday, and yeah, took. Uh, uh, took the large, what's it called now, master plan here, um, almost four hours ago, we're gonna be active here in 40 minutes. So we have saved some rest here on the account for the last three hours or so. Um, 2.5, 1.7, 1.6, 1 1.6, gonna need around 10 million, um, maybe almost overflow here. Gonna need 10 million here in cap, uh, we're only gonna do cap, um, gonna do like, uh, Great Granaries and four uh, Great Houses. Uh, that's gonna enable us to make, I think it's level 19 fields, um, almost 2 mil capacity in crop and uh, 960k in, uh, in warehouse. So that's gonna be nice. Um, might also pump a few into the hammer. Um, definitely use it. Maybe we're gonna build this as PVK. I'm not 100% sure yet. Uh, but yeah, Q is still going just a bit. Just saving all rest now for uh, for the crates. Just yet, queues are the queues are almost out. Uh, the hammer queues are still going okay. Bodies, more or less going. Um, see, uh, when we get rid of uh, storage artifacts again, we're probably gonna have a CB for two villages. Gonna chief probably a few more. Better uh, chief instead of settle. And we see, see, we overflow now. Uh, stat wise, we're now up to number three pop. Uh, yeah, with the storage. Uh, yes. Top 10, nothing real to show. 47 million rated, we're not rating almost at all. Let's put a 11. So far, still on my 11 as well. A hammer here, number 75, spawn 108. Death rank up to number 7. Uh, just a few ranks yesterday. Uh, just from yeah, losing off troops. Obviously, that counts a lot when you're playing Roman at least. Um, yeah, CB with A3, and so far we're number 5. Uh, yeah, that was just a little small update for today. Um, nothing really new on the account, except the two artifact villages, but uh, yeah, I'll see you again tomorrow. It is now day 11 on the server, and time for a little update again here. Uh, so yesterday we had the storage artifacts and we used it in four villages. First of all, we used it in capital. We made, yeah, there must be 10 great granaries and four great warehouses. Um, this means we have capacity to make level 19 fields. I'm not sure if we're gonna build them, but yeah, we have the option if we want to. So yeah, cap is looking great now. Just gonna, yeah, more or less slow sim the fields. Um, We'll for sure have all fields level 17 or more, probably also start on level 18. And then we also placed yeah, two great granaries and a great warehouse in our hammer. And then the main scout town also got one of each. And then spawn hammer got, yeah, there's just one great granary. Um, just to get the bit up for, uh, from the rating here. So yeah, that's what we made. Uh, yeah, pretty nice overall, costed our... 10 million rest, but uh, yeah, this is looking pretty good now. And uh, yeah, we moved the eyes to the rotation village, as I talked about uh, in the last recording, so that's here now. Um, and yeah, obviously let storage go to the next few people, so they, uh, yeah, we don't have it now, uh, probably won't for a long time, but yeah, we're still going to have to defend it. And then we got three new villagers, achieved uh, three today, so this is the first one, achieved it from this guy. Shuma, or what he's called, just inactive, so it's gonna free 
was just a free village. Probably also gonna achieve this when I have CP here. Uh, and it's just, yeah, above cap area here, so that's yeah, a nice position and probably just gonna be another supporter. Um, and then we achieve two here. Uh, so these two, we achieved then from this guy Andrew, um, also zeroed four of his villages, I'll show that a bit later. But yeah, achieved these two really nice villages, six, seven hundred pop. Um, yeah, probably also just gonna be um, supporters yeah, around spawn area. Um, yeah, so that's pretty good. Um, besides that on the account, I don't think there's anything else really new. Uh, we started on scouts here and BO2 and BO3 as well. You can see all the infrastructure here. Oh, that's not this one. This one. It's more or less the same as the main scout village. Um, have hospital and tournament square a bit lower. I want to get tournament square up here as well. Uh, horse drinking trough level 17. It doesn't matter if we upgrade it more. It doesn't make any change. Um, it's the same here. 16 is the lowest that it's actually going to change here. Um, it's still going to be 14 if we upgrade it to 20, so that's not worth it. Um, but yeah, these three villages are now pumping out def, uh, mid scout. Um, yeah, Q-wise, everything is more or less going, just spawn that's slacking a bit. We are busy today fighting this Andrew guy, um, so we are all troops home, and that means, yeah, no raiding. Um, yeah, culture points, yeah, all parties more or less going. These are not level 10 yet, so we can run grades here, the same here. And the troop count, yeah, we also lost a lot of diff, I'll show you that as well. So we're now down to almost 100k uh, Praetorians. Imps, uh, 23k, 28k uh, EI scouts, now up to 27k. Uh, across these three uh, scout villages, we got to make like 21k uh, per day, 7k in each. So yeah, that's going to grow really nice. Uh, and yeah, the main hammer here looking pretty good. We have trainer here right now, so we have queued a lot of Katas. Show this here. Uh, 31 hours, maybe gonna queue a bit more. Um, but yeah, besides that, I have the reports I can show you. Uh, this one was during the night, probably right after I recorded last. Uh, while this Radiohead guy uh, just had, had a, a few of our def in here, just yeah, nice little wall here. And then we walled this from. Ayman Sayyid on Ace Ventura, uh, FNAC, yeah, doing the morning, 8.17. Um, yeah, managed to get a pretty big dev wall in here as well. But this is a guy that's pretty yeah, controversial. Um, he's just farming all these techs, multi-accounts, whatever you want to call them. Um, he says it's just his friends that he farms, but it's, yeah, something fishy is going on here. Um, one hour he farms 3 million and the next 5 hours he don't read anything. So yeah, this is pretty obviously multi-accounts or tick or whatever. Um, but yeah, what well, this guy, pretty nice hammer, but yeah, you walled it pretty easy. And then I zeroed three guys from this Andrew guy. Um, these were all around spawn. They were like, yeah, you can see them here today. These two, where else? Here was one and there was one more somewhere. Um, but yeah, zero three village from this guy. Here and here as well. And we also stole the artifact from this guy. We originally wanted to chief his villages, but since he had um, yeah, the large confusion, we couldn't target. Uh, so we had to take it first. Um, we did that, but it ended up being a lot more costly than we thought. Um, so this was the clearing game from Iron Man. I think we scouted him and saw maybe like 5 10k diff. And then he had almost lost his hammer. Um, at least he got through, and then we stole it. And uh, yeah, meanwhile we did this as several three of his villages. Um, but yeah, we managed to get it, and now we have it in our spawn. Probably gonna move it pretty soon since we can use it while Unicai is active. And then we all two really big hammers. Uh, I think this was in top five, top ten maybe. I'm not completely sure somewhere there. Um, really big hammer from Akasa hitting Master Yoda on Unique Trainer. And uh, once you get pretty nice def in here, uh, can I see the numbers? Okay, I can't. Uh, but yeah, over 200k def in here. Um, these were all our Praetorians that we could get there in time. Uh, so we, <laughs> that's why we lost like 50, 60k Praetorians. Uh, I can show the hospital as well. Um, but yeah, he killed, yeah, what did he kill? On the half of it here. Really nice Amber, not a lot of Rams though. 
And then this guy, Dragon, no ramps, no katas. Not sure why. Uh, pretty nice hammer though. Um, managed to kill around half of the remaining death, uh, a bit more. Um, so yeah, a really nice hammer again, but uh, yeah, we lost a lot of patrons here, which is pretty annoying. <laughs> um, oh, here we chief. I'll oh, shoot another bit from Andrew as well. And here's another one. <laughs> we chief the LR, shoot him a lot. Um, yeah, just kidding up the area around spawn. Um, what did I want to show you? I think it was the hospital. Um, yeah, this is how the hospitals are looking now. Over 20k Patreons in here. It's gonna cost around 10 million. Um, yeah, to revive these. So that's what I'm gonna use the rest of the night for, probably. Um, yeah, I think that was more or less it. I'm sure show the stats as well. Pop in now up to number 2 with the 3 new chief villagers. Rating 65 million. Uh, zero stats here, 7, 9, off, 69, nice, diff, 15 with the, the big losses, so I'm kind of surprised we're still so high, and here's CP, 3 and 4, but yeah, that was just the update for today, kind of big update, a lot of stuff happened today, uh, but yeah, I'll see you again tomorrow. It is now day 12 on the server, and time for a little update. If we start with cap here, we got all field 17 uh, yesterday evening. And then, yeah, we're close to finishing 18 now and need three more. Otherwise, we're probably just gonna do a few 19s a day here in the next coming days. Uh, they're pretty expensive, it's like two and a half million each, yeah. And that's basically one hour production without rating and such, uh, so yeah, it's kind of expensive. Um, but yeah, that's the new for cap. Otherwise, we achieved two new villages today. Uh, first one is above the village uh, achieved yesterday. It's from the same guy here, the Shuma. Um, yeah, still inactive, so it was pretty easy to achieve. Send four chief, and then we got it. And uh, now we're just slowly simming fields up here, getting this done. And then we achieved this one as well. This is just under the spawn area here, this one. Um, let's show the clearing here. This guy. Uh, he was, he's not inactive, but he's not playing too much. So we have some clearing wave here, and then uh, two waves here. First three chiefs from the hammer, and then just another one here. That was enough to take it. And uh, yeah, already finished fields here, and now just simming the um, yeah like the inner city here. Uh, actually, some people have asked me what like these letters are behind uh, or after the village names, and it's basically just like notes for for, my, for myself. Um, so here we have like an O after, and that's just telling me like uh, I still need to sim fields here. So that means also here in uh, AO1 I still need to re to do fields here. If we take a look at the other ones, they have all fields maxed, so that's what the O means. And uh, also have an R here, and that just means uh, yeah I need to sim residence to 20. So that's what I'm doing in these two. Um, also have a few other letters, but yeah, this is just the most common that I use. Um, besides that in the account, yeah, we still have the unique eyes, uh, and then we also still have uh, the great confusion here in spawn, uh, still just holding it until someone want to take it, uh, it's more than waste, wasted on our account. Um, and then we have trainer here in the hammer village, gonna be active in, yeah, actually five minutes, um, mainly just gonna focus on katas, uh, yeah, we don't have too much rest, so we can't really queue. Um, like the whole hammer, uh, like 30 hours or so, we don't have the rest for that. So I'm just gonna focus Katas here, and yeah, slowly getting uh, more and more risk ready for it. Have like 4 million on the account at the moment, so uh, yeah, just gonna all be put into Katas and make like 30 hours queues or so. Um, and yeah, just the queues here, just slow and steady, going fine. Um, spawn is still kind of slacking, maybe just making uh, EIs here now. Not really making any uh, appearance or siege here, um, but yeah, the overall troop numbers up to 144k uh, Praetorians, EIs for the true hammers, almost 30k scouts now up to 43k, uh, yeah, with the only guys, and EIs went up to 33k and siege here, and um, yeah, Rams 1400, uh, Ketas up to 6300, and yeah, this Ketas account is just gonna keep rising pretty fast now with the trainer. And uh, yeah, I have a few reports here I can show you. Um, 
First one we will two hammer on Tim Cornier from this I think it's Czechish. I'm not completely sure, but wall two hammer here. This is just like a random outpost just to farm from with the hero and such. Um so yeah, well this hammer managed to get a lot of diff in here actually. Um and the next one here just a bit smaller again just walled. And then Yoda was out hunting with his newest hammer. I think he made this yesterday. Um just to fuck with these fan guys. You have like a personal vendetta against this against these guys. So here first attack, killed some uh, phalanx here and lost a, a bit here. And then he waited a bit and just ran again with it. And again, just murdering a, a lot of phalanx. And he keeps going, he just don't stop Yoda. <laughs> um, again here just getting even more phalanx. And, and yeah, by tomorrow he will have 40k clubs again here and then he'll just keep murdering all the defense until they're gone. Uh, so yeah, that's doing pretty good. And Espanol caught a hammer home or follow home. I'm not completely sure about that. Um, yeah, hitting the Turk player here. Obviously 10 ramps. That's just how the Turks operate. Um, a lot of horses compared to clubs. Uh, he might be raiding with these, I guess. But uh, yeah, for these 9k TKs, you should have around 40k clubs or so. Um, so yeah, his hammer is definitely crippled now. Um, yeah, nice attack. And then Fusion here got walled a bit earlier today. Uh, I'm not completely sure what he hit. Um, doesn't seem to be artifact village or anything. Probably just wants to cut his village down. But yeah, he also yeah just barely got walled here. We can't see the, all the diff numbers here, but uh, yeah, otherwise nice attack, nice hammer. Uh, and then yeah, stats, uh, probably step number two, uh, worth showing here, I don't think so, rating 12 million, just slow and steady again here. And the general stats here, respite day number four, so far number nine, off here, number 65 with the main hammer, and yeah, this is without greats, just basically trainer with uh, the Kazas. Sword EIs, yeah, 21 diff, now we're number 13, and here's CP today, we're number 3, and so far we're number 3 as well. But yeah, that was just a little update for today, and now I will get started on the trainer queues. It is now day 13, and time for our little update again here. If we start off with Capital, we finished all level 18s uh, during the night, and then we started on level 19s. Uh, yeah, we're all, almost uh, halfway. Uh, I guess we are. We, uh, yeah, I made 7 out of the 15 to level 19. Hopefully gonna finish them tomorrow, not completely sure, but uh, yeah, it's doing pretty good now. Producing, yeah, almost 1.3 million an hour now. Um, I think new here, not really. Achieved another village today, if it's gonna load. I guess it's pretty slow. Um, so yeah, we have a 27 villages, we achieved this one. This is, yeah, just down and to the left from uh, our cluster here. Um, yeah, nothing really to show here. <laughs> there was no defense, more or less inactive player. So, yeah, that was just for free. Um, still need to do fields if it's going to load again. Here, uh, yeah, fields and some infrastructure here. Otherwise, that's going to be good to go. Uh, just another supporter. Um, Otherwise, in the account, not too much. Uh, we have fake incoming on spawn. If it's gonna load again, not completely sure what's going on here. Uh, this guy, uh, Ollie, for some reason didn't see that we have a few new guys, uh, so he actually sent this and two other attacks. He also sent a fake to our hammer. Um, just got trainer in it, so he sent this, and we could easily see this was fake, so we knew this wasn't the spot. Um, but then he also sent attack to BO2, our biggest scout village. I'm guessing he just chose this one because it's uh, yeah the biggest pub we have. It's so slow today, what the fuck? Uh, here, I've, I guess he just didn't scroll uh, far enough down to see we had unique guys. Um, so yeah, he sent that we can see that hero and all the different type of troops. So we got, what is it here? Uh, 240k death here in time. So we saw all these type of troops. Have we know? Yeah, this is uh, most likely a real attack. Um, so yeah, managed to get yeah these 200k death in like 30 minutes. Uh, 
Obviously, these are all our Praetorians. We also had our hero here, but <laughs> he was a Dutch. Uh, we actually didn't see that. Um, it's the first time we're getting attacked on the server, so we haven't even tried, uh, you know, getting attacked here and actually see uh, that the hero was on Dutch. But now we know that for the next time. Um, but yeah, this guy just got completely walled. He is right next to our capital. So this is the village he hit. Okay, it's just not loading today. Good time I uh, started recording, I guess. Holy shit. Uh, this is here, our village. Cab area here. And he is right here. Um, so yeah, he lost all his troops. Scouted all his villages, uh, as you can see here. Probably gonna try to chief this guy during the next few days. Otherwise, maybe just zero him. Um, yeah, just to clear up the area a bit. Um, but yeah, that's pretty nice. Wall well, the hammer in our area, so we didn't have to actually go hunt it instead. So um, yeah, all in all, really successful. And I have a few reports I can show you. Nothing really special. Um, first one here from Star Wars hitting Clubman. Um, not sure if this was him trying to follow home or just a random attack. Um, but yeah, he got hardwalled here. I don't have the full report, but you can see the losses here are really small. Um, so yeah, this got bolt. And then our teammate Espanol uh, got this hammer at home, sending in 11k TTs. Um, yeah, getting 10k clubs, a few catas. I mean, why not? And then this one, actually quite an interesting report. So the mask here uh, sent on this guy, caught some of his hammer home, if not all, I'm not sure about that. Um, but yeah, uh, the funny thing about this report is. Out of every troop in this report, only one survived, <laughs> and this is one club from this XG guy. Uh, you can also see that here in the statistic. Uh, no troops from the mask survived, and uh, yeah, <laughs> one troop from this guy survived. This is actually really rare to see, um, so yeah, quite a fun sight to see. Um, just a little interesting report here. And if we take a more general look on the account, Okay, if we can. It's super slow today, what the fuck. Uh, Q's still going, spawn still slacking as usual, that's fine. If we take a look at the troop numbers, um, Praetorians, 174k. Uh, I think we only lost like 5k in the previous attack on BO2. Uh, Imperians now up to 31k total. Oh, yeah, that's Imperian. Uh, and Scouts here up to 54k. Just getting bigger and bigger every day now. Um, EI, and EI 36k, uh, Rams, yeah, 1400, uh, not focusing seeds here in spawn really, and obviously not PvK, you're just gonna focus Rams, uh, sorry, Minketas, uh, and yeah, we're up to 7.6k in total, uh, and yeah, slowly getting more and more chiefs ready, um, yeah, just to keep chiefing instead of uh, settling, it's just way easier and faster, um, Parties, still large parties going all the villages. Uh, yeah, besides our only guy village, haven't really been doing much in here. And then the two newest villages uh, don't even have town hall yet here. Um, some general stats pop. Now number three. Uh, since last recording, Yoda have got nine new villages. Um, he's also number one CP so far. Uh, so he have. Yeah, both take me and Ace Ventura uh, down for top two. Um, so yeah, he's just popping out now. Top ten rating, nah, 22 million is nothing special. We don't send it too much, uh, to be honest. Um, rest per day, actually number four now. I haven't seen that. Uh, I think yesterday we were number six or nine even. I can't remember, but now we're number four per day. That's really nice. Uh, so far number nine. Defensive, still slowly catching up with the VVK here, 64, and here, yeah, spawn 130. Uh, defense, uh, 13 and 8. I'm pretty sure we have all in top 5 def, and then more or less, uh, yeah, dominating the top 15, right? Uh, I know in offense we have, I think it's top 13 for sure. I don't know about the rest, but at least uh, top 13. And you see people day three and still number three here and so far as well. Uh, but yeah, that was it for this little update and this video. 
hope you all enjoyed and i will see you again in the next one